M0FXB, welcome to my channel and my videos on the ICOM ID52. M0FXB, so we're going to do the firmware upload for my ICOM52. This one I got from Japan, um, and it had the 1.20 on there actually last. Um, but the one we're going to download now is the 1. Point version 1.22, uh, released, uh, looks like it, uh, October. So let's uh, download it. I'll go all the way to the bottom and click download. That's the file we're going to use. Quick look at the instructions, which are on this same page. Download the um, file. I know the firmware update screen, will, will, I'll show you that. When you've got the file, it says here, extract the file folder of the micro SD card. Insert the SD card with the firmware update uh, into the radio. Update the, yeah, I know that procedure. So basically, I'll show you the file. See this data file here, 52J122. That's the one we're going to be using. We're going to uh, copy that into our SD card. SD card out, so let's turn it off. The SD card is here, like so, and we can sort of push it with our thumb so it clicks. Yeah, once it clicks, it does poke out, and then I'm just going to use these carefully, use these tweezers to slide it out and put it into my adapter, like so. And then uh, over to the PC. So we're at the PC. We've plugged the SD card into the adapter. And let's go to the file, the computer first. Uh, there it is there, the actual drive. The ID52 there in my F, is it F drive? So uh, what we actually want is my to go into my ICOM52 file. So let's copy it I think we'll copy it and paste it in here so go to icon 52 this one here and we want on my one we want the J because I've got the Japan model but you would want if you're in UK the E one or if you're in USA the A one so 52 E 52 A I want 52 J so copy that copy and go back to my computer F drive, like so, and then I'll paste it here for now. That's the one I want. And then I'm pretty sure I've got to drag it up here. It, you know, we'll try, but I'll drag it up here for now, and then we'll go and try it on the radio. Like so, move to 52. There you go. And then we'll safely extract by going right click and then eject. And then we can unplug it and take it to our radio. Look at the radio, we're going to slide it in that way round, just try it that way round, no that doesn't feel right so it's the other way round with the gold facing the front, You've got to be really careful with this especially on the 705 you can actually lose it in the radio so it's in there and you just want that click, it definitely clicked, obviously make sure it's off when you do it. We've got the file in there. Let's see if we put it in the right place. So we turn it on. Then um, we'll go turn it down. Um, let's move away from an active channel. We don't really want that. So we'll go menu, set. We'll go to SD card. And this time we're going to go down to firmware. So firmware update. And we're looking for that file, aren't we? So let's read to the bottom of the warning. So yes, yes, it make automatically makes a backup for you. Need to make sure you've got a nice full battery when you're doing this. Okay, done that. So there it is there, 52J122, so we'll click select. And then we'll go, do you want to start? And we'll go yes. Check in the file. And loading, so we'll have the firmware version 1.22, and 
even the 52E and the 52A have got version 1.22. And afterwards, we'll just turn it on. We've taken a backup so we can reload, you know, the uh, backup of all our repeaters and memories and everything. So look, version 1.22 there. As it booted and everything's back to normal. Uh, that's it really so if you want to load your old version of memories if you need to just go menu set SD card go up load settings and look you can load the previous settings there choose the one and click select uh, but I'm happy with mine so 73 thanks for watching a firmware update 1.22 and it's December 2021 Wishing you all a very Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year from M0FXB. 7-3, all the best.